All right. Welcome to Thursday Stand Up. Our, before we start, can we have a small uh, wellness check-in? Just send us the reaction of how you are feeling today, a reaction that reflects your mood today. Okay. Okay. I can see that majority of us are doing well, very well. Okay. That's super amazing because we are approaching the end of the week. So yeah, welcome to Thursday Stand Up. Let's get started uh, with sharing our progress. How was yesterday? And how is today? How are you planning to uh, to run this Thursday? And um, any blockers or any support you need so far? Let's start with the people who are ready, very sharp people who are ready to present quickly. <clears throat> Anyone, let's raise our hands. If you are ready to share, all right, Mubarak. Others, you can be raising your hand as uh, Mubarak presents. So Mubarak, the floor is yours. Hello, everyone. Uh, am I audible? Yes, you are. OK. Uh, yeah, for yesterday, uh, I tried to uh, do a simple uh, rug. Uh, a, wearing, a working rug and it works uh, and also uh, for today I'm uh, reviewing the changing mechanism and also try to do the uh, evaluation of the rug uh, and updating based on that uh, and also I have uh, submitted my deliverables on time yeah that is it. all right amazing Mubarak keep it up and kudos to you for submitting on time as well. Yeah, let's hear the next. Yes, Mikias, and then Rodolfo, we follow. Can you? Yeah, we can. Sorry, yeah, I think I have common COVID, so my voice may, might be like the usual. So yesterday I was working. I think I can have the same progress as Mubarak. I was able to implement the simple rug uh, using the document given, and I was also able to submit the deliverables uh, on time. And today uh, I will be working on also chunking and uh, testing, uh, I mean, going over uh, Lama, I mean, uh, Ragas. So that's what I will be doing. And that's my progress so far. Thank you. All right, Mikias, keep it up as well. Let's hear from Rudolf. Good morning, Pascal, and good morning, everyone. Good morning. So yesterday, uh, I tried to to submit my work on time, but I did. Uh, I, I was able to submit one on time, which was the my GitHub code. Uh, when it comes to the to the report, uh, I was a bit late for that. So, but I, I submitted uh, like uh, a thirty minutes later. Okay. Apart from that, um, I was able to to set up to build a neighbor rug. And uh, today, I will start working on the different part of the evaluation start from the chunking as my friend have already said it so this is the plan for today thank you all right amazing Rodolf. keep it up with today's plan as well uh let's see for more people Let's be sharp, let's be sharp and voluntarily share our updates. All right, we have Basilel. Actually, again, um, yep, to avoid uh, spending time waiting, let's do it like how Basilel and Carol and Miss Gano are doing it. Raise your hand if you are ready to share. 
So let's start with Basilel and then Kerod and then Miss Gano and then Birahem. Hi guys, can you hear me? Yes, we can hear you. Uh, all right, good morning. So I think we're pretty much at the at a similar level. Uh, I've been trying to build a basic pipeline uh, to yeah to to just have a normal rug, a naive rug. It's not doing anything, but you know it it just does what a basic rug does. And yeah, I am now proceeding to try to evaluate it with rug, and then and then see how it's doing, and then we'll take it from there. So that's my update. Uh, I haven't really progressed uh, as much as I had hoped for. Uh, personally, keep it up. I hope you managed to progress for today to make a good progress you want to see as well. Yep. Let's continue with Carol. Good morning, everyone. Uh, uh, OK. As for my part, uh, well, ye yesterday I didn't do much because I had a bit of a long day, a difficult day, but uh, I also wanted to check out a new uh, database, a vector da da data store, but I am having a bit of bugs. So, uh, yeah, I didn't also progress as I have, to, I have hoped for, but for today, I plan to look into the bugs of the this new uh, vector store that i was i'm trying out but if it uh, if I, if it doesn't work after two hours i'm i'm planning to switch back to the vector store that i was using earlier for the last project yeah hopefully i will get it done by i don't know like four hours from now hopefully yeah okay. that's my update and for the rest of the work yeah have the rest of the day. Thank you. Okay, amazing, Carol. Uh, keep it up as well. Let's hear from Miss Gano. And of course, if we have any blocker, this rate raise it. Miss Gano, the floor is yours. Yeah, uh, for my updates yesterday, so I tried to implement a simple rug, just a simple rug, uh, yeah, using text splitter. Chunking, yeah, it was not efficient. So I tried to experiment on the chunking part. I tried different chunking methods. Yeah, then after that, I started working on the interim submission. And I did submit on time. And my plan for today is to work on the evaluation part and to make uh, the rag better. And yeah, that's my update. Thank you. All right, keep it up, Miss Gano, as well. Uh, let's proceed to Birahan. Am I audible? Hello, everyone. Yes, you are. I'm sorry, there is a little bit of noise. I can't run away from it. So bear with me if I can lose my little bit. Good morning, everyone. Um, yesterday was actually good. I did the report and do the researches and then work on in detail in the rankings and making them usable for different cases and try to figure out the different treatment mechanisms and then um, define classes for them. That's what I did yesterday. Today, I will be working more on um, the databases and the different retrievers and the different embeddings. So that's my plan for today, but of course, we'll move to the next task. Thank you. All right, amazing, Bira again. Keep it up as well. Uh, let's proceed to Abraham. Uh, good morning, everyone. Good morning. Um, so yesterday I was trying to work on uh, a few of the implementation of the rug. Uh, and I was trying to build a simple rug, but I was having a few errors and uh, I could not get past those errors. So I just went on to working on my submission. So today I plan on uh, finalizing what I tried to do yesterday and uh, further heading on with the project tasks. Uh, that's it from my end. All right. Yep. Keep it up, Abraham, as well. Uh, let's hear from more people. 
we have Musa. Yes, Musa, you can go ahead for now. Good morning, everyone. Good so, morning. yeah, yesterday I tried to create a simple rod. I think every one of us were trying to do that. And I kind of tried chatting with it using the evaluation data set that was provided. So uh, the rug actually doesn't seem to uh, get some questions right. And I was wondering if other people, like they were trying different chunking mechanisms, and what exactly are you trying to test it with? So are you, going, are you uh, actually chunking the texts and then embedding them on, into a vector store? and then trying to retrieve them and then asking the questions? Or is there a simple way without actually embedding them into a vector store and directly um, trying them? So I, I, I wanted an insight in this. So besides that, I wrote my interim report and I'm hoping to continue on the project today. So yeah, thank you. All right, Musa. I hope we heard Mrs. question. Uh, what do you think, guys? How is it going for you? Anyone who wants to support? Or do you want him to repeat the question? We say you can repeat the question again. Yeah, so just to make it clear, I wanted mm -hmm. to know are you guys are testing the chunking mechanisms? Are you like going the longer way of chunking them and then embedding them? And then maybe trying to retrieve and generate uh, a, 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 an answer from the LLM? Or is there a simple way of doing uh, the testing for the chunking mechanisms? Because I, I am asking this, uh, the embedding actually costs money. And as we know, the PDF is about 73 pages and each time I try to change the chunking mechanism and then I try to embed it into a vector store. I am actually uh, incurring costs yeah, for the 10 Academy team. So I was wondering if there is another way of doing it or maybe this is the only way of doing it. All right, I think we heard the question, guys, anyone? Yes, Abel. So, yes, uh, I understand your concern. Um, so, so, the thing is, there are two things uh, where we should consider when coming to thinking. So, one is the chunking size, and the other is the chunking method. So, there is a character uh, chunking, a uh, text splitting chain chunking. There's many uh, ways to chunk using the long chain uh, framework. So. Uh, the charging size, uh, you there is a way uh, for you to analyze its reverse retrieval state and other uh, factors that might affect it. So, uh, I'm going to show you the link uh, that it uses the lama index so that it can uh, see the average response time, testfulness, and rele relevancy. So, those three things uh, you might do it uh, without using the Invader, uh, and you can uh, see the results and select the ones that suited it. For the uh, actual uh, mechanism, I'm not sure if there is a way because it directly affects the outcome of the rag. And uh, if anyone can have found a way for the mechanisms, uh, I would like to hear their way. So, so that's the one thing I can say. Thank you, Abel. Do please share the link. And if anyone else, if anyone else has anything to add on any other alternative ways, as Abel said, so please do. All right, guys. Anyone? Anyone who can support further? Or do we have uh, Emtina or Rehmet?
Emtina Rahmet. So Pascaline, it's okay. Um, we can I oh. can continue doing it uh, this way. So it's all right. Okay. Yeah. All right. If you can figure out or if you can manage, then it's all right. Okay, Musa. Yeah. Yeah. Thank you. Okay. 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 All right. Because I can see uh, some people like Rudolf said they haven't done that yet. They will be focusing on that for today. So uh, okay, let's uh, let's hope for further Slack communication regarding that moving forward. Okay. So let's continue with the stand up. Uh, let's see more people who are ready to share now. Hello. All right, Daniel, you can go ahead. Okay, good morning, everyone. Good morning. Okay, uh, yesterday I was able to just submit my interim report and uh, I was trying to implement a simple rack. As uh, Abdul Hamid already mentioned it, uh, after chunking uh, the, the given data, data uh, which is uh, for the evaluation, uh, I try to test it using the QA. Uh, uh, it is not performing uh, well. Uh, it got some wrong answer. And uh, uh, I was trying to just change my chunking method. Uh, basically, I just uh, implement the semantic chunking and uh, there are also other chunking methods uh, I just looked up on on uh, the internet, but uh, it might incur substantial amount of uh, cost. So uh, I just implement the semantic chunking method, but I don't know. I still don't figure it figure it out uh, why it is not getting the correct answer. So. Uh, before change, changing my chunking method, for now, uh, I just uh, try to craft a prompt uh, which is more directive and I try to give it uh, the example as well. Hopefully, uh, it, will be, it will form as intended and this is uh, my report for now. Thank you. Okay, amazing, Daniel. Keep it up. Uh, yeah, and in case of any blockers, uh, yeah. raise it and then we talk about it. Yeah, okay. Uh, uh, the blockers already mentioned by Abdul Hamid. So if anyone has uh, a method to just pasting the chunking before embedding it, uh, it will be very nice. Okay. Thank you. Uh, yeah, let's wait to see if we find someone who can help us further. Uh, so to the people who are listed in the chat box, Aaron, Ekram, AI, Amekdes, Meron, Melat. Aaron and AI say that we'll be sharing in the chat box. So let's move forward with Ekram and then Mekdes. All right, Ekram. Okay, hello everyone. I hope you can hear me. So like yep. yesterday was not so much of a productive day for me, but I have tried to progress. And uh, so what did I do? Uh, the first one is I was able to deliver my deliverables on time. And also I have tried to progress on building a language based drug pipeline. Uh, and my plan for today is to try to improve uh, the performance of Zarag using a different methods, uh, different embedding models and retrievers and also different chunking methods. Uh, and also to progress on RAG, to do a RAG evaluation using RAGAS framework. Thanks. All right, keep it up, Ekram. 
Yep, uh, let's move forward with Aya. If you're ready to speak, the floor is yours. Uh, good morning, Pascaline and everyone. Uh, so yesterday, um, as everybody did, uh, I was able to uh, set up the RAG pipeline for QND. Um, it works, but sometimes it hallucinates. Uh, I think that's because of the, the document and maybe uh, the, uh, the character text splitter that I used. Maybe I should work on that. Uh, and also I have uh, submitted a, a report. Uh, that's all about yesterday. Today, uh, I will be working on uh, improving the um, uh, retriever part of the RAG system. Uh, that's all I have. Uh, I think somebody asked about how, I think, is it, was it up to? Uh, how to use the local embedding without using the open AI? It, it was breaking up. I, I couldn't listen the whole question. Oh. So, yeah, I can repeat the question. Okay. Uh, what I was asking about earlier was trying different chunking mechanisms without actually then embedding them uh, into uh, a vector store. So, once I chunk them, I want to test whether the chunking is actually uh, performing better without using the, actually, yeah, without using the OpenAI model. So can we do that locally? Uh, without using uh, the OpenAI embedding, you mean, right? Yeah, yeah. Uh, yes and no. Uh, uh, there is uh, one embedder that doesn't involve the OpenAI key. Uh, which is, I think, a sentence transformer embedding functions. I used it with uh, the uh, recursive character splitter. The only time that we need the open AI key is during the RAG retrieval. That means for the, the chat completion. So yes, uh, I said no, uh, because I might not, I mean, it might not work for other uh, Chunking methods. I mean the the uh, synthesis transformer embedding function. Yeah. Okay. I hope that. Okay, helps. I into the, Yeah. Yeah, it does. Thank you. Yeah. Yeah. Good. All right. Amazing. Uh, Daniel, did you manage to hear and Abel as well? Did you manage to hear AI as you? Okay, all right. Yep, let's move forward then to Meron. Okay, good morning. Good morning. Yesterday, uh, I worked on the, del the deliverable. I prepared the interim report and submitted on time and I have implemented simple rack uh, and today I will improve my rack system and I will read about long, long chain chunking mechanism and I will work on uh, evaluation part. Thank you. Okay, all right, Marun. Uh, for the progress since yesterday, keep it up as well. So let's hear from Melat and then Mubarak. Uh, good morning, guys. So my, my update from yesterday was I was able to submit the interim report. Uh, I was also doing research on the right, uh, on the papers that were given to us. Uh, I was also able to set up a simple RAG, but I wasn't able to progress with the uh, database that I, that I wanted because of I went into some problems and I thought I'd, I thought I'd just set up the 
plug pipeline with another database and then I would change it later on once I have figured out how it works. So, uh, so for today, I think I'm going to be researching on the database that I have selected and get it to work. So this is uh, my update. Okay, thank you so much, Melat. Uh, so, uh, good progress to everyone, and also kudos to everyone who managed to submit on time. Uh, let's look forward to today's agenda, and if we have any point of discussion before we leave the call, we can raise it and then uh, we'll discuss about it. We still have a few minutes left. Anyone? Anyone? Okay, going three, going two, all right, Ayaya. Uh, yeah, uh, about the, the data, um, uh, I think we uh, need to create uh, a ground rules for uh, testing and evaluating. And Yabal yesterday told us to parse it and uh, try to get some uh, uh, data out of it. But the the uh, the data, I think, I mean, the, the Word document, it's kind of copy-paste. So the, the articles are like, in Roman and in, in in Arabic and in other places, they are in Arabic. There is uh, some inconsistency. Uh, so, if someone at the Ten Academy team have a look at it and say something about it, thank you. Okay, uh, yeah, yeah. Would you mind also raising that on Slack and uh, tag Yabi, Rahmet, or Emtina? For quick support okay we'll do okay yeah thank you so much any other point of discussion or question all right uh i think we are okay for now all of us so see you in the today's tutorials and uh, non-technical tutorial and also the guest talk that we have uh, in this afternoon. Yep. Have a great day, everyone. Thank you for joining the stand-up.